Peace, peace, you all. Salaam alaikum. Omar here. Happy Sunday to you. I'm getting my relatively long run in. I actually feel like I'm getting some of my stamina back. So this run has got to be about six miles, inshallah. Lord willing. But um, I feel good, man. I just got off a night shift and I feel really good. Ooh. But anyway, for those of you guys that don't know me, I'm a physician associate, moderately fit, middle-aged, endurance athlete, family man, and doctor of health education. So, as I run through these beautiful trails of Washington, D.C., Rock Creek Park, I want to talk to you guys a bit about the importance of belief. We in America are in, a, in an election year. And I think there are one, there's election years going on around the world, also like Canada and other places. So there's some hotly contested issues. And a lot of them, a lot, oh, sorry guys. Gotcha. Hey, how are you? So a lot of these issues are, have to do with our beliefs. And we speak up a bit. Hey, thank you very much. You know, so we hold our our beliefs to be sacred, you know. I hate the idea of forcing somebody, trying to force somebody to follow your beliefs. You know, whether that's through like constantly cajoling them or, or threatening them with bodily harm, you know. That's an anathema to me personally. That's one of my beliefs. So, you know, that's going on around the world. Hey, um, we have, uh, here in the U.S., we got the Democrats versus the Republicans versus uh, some of the also rands in, um, you know, Independence and Greenpeace or whoever. I mean, uh, the Green Party, whatever political party we have. Hey, hey. hey. so, you know, people are... The vehemence and the vitriol that's being spewed back and forth about who's best, Trump or Biden, <laughs> and how we're, they're going to do stuff to the opposing party. It's quite sad. I guess. But, um, you know, I think we can do better as a species of homo, homo sapiens, supposedly advanced, <laughs> supposedly in our civilized world. <laughs> but, um... We don't seem to be doing that well. But, you know, beliefs are important. And when people feel like they're tread upon those beliefs, they, uh, they have the right to defend themselves with, uh, within certain measures. You don't have to go overboard, as we're seeing around the world. <laughs> but, um, you know, just try to do your best to hold your beliefs. You know, in, in the U.S., we got this thing. We hold these truths to be self-evident that all men are created equal. <laughs> Uh, you know how how that goes the uh, Declaration of Independence, <laughs> but um, that wasn't true for uh, for um, I guess the uh, Constitution or whatever. It's hard to run and think higher th history at the same time, but um, you know those. I guess my point is that um, you know a lot of these things that, that uh, we hold dear. We have defended them in each, in each society. Uh, it's caused a lot of bloodshed, a lot of slavery, a lot of oppression of other people <laughs> that were not as strong as whatever prevailing person or people <laughs> who, um, who are trying to force their beliefs on others. Um, but I tell people, you know, to try to believe in themselves first and foremost. You know, believe in whatever deity, you know, that you may perceive, you know, if it's uh, whatever religion you may happen to have. But uh, also believe in yourself. Believe in your abilities. Those abilities can uh, be taken from you by fate. I'm out here running. I'm not as fast as I used to be. I could tr break my leg. On your left. How you doing? Good, Thanks. But, um, you know, you just... You want to um, try to... Um, have self-confidence and believe that you're, you have the capability of doing whatever it is you're trying to do. You know, along with that line of uh, goal setting. You can do it. You're stronger than you realize and smarter than you realize. 
and many, if not most of us, are more uh, resilient just going than uh, than we than we give our cred ourselves credit for. But that's it for now. For those of you guys that want to be uh, PAs or uh, physician associates like me, all oh, day, fast kid. Um, you know, feel free to um, subscribe to my channel if you want. If not, that's cool too. <laughs> my life will go on. Hey there. Um, I've been doing, uh, been a PA for almost 25 years now. It's a great profession. I would not have stayed in it this long had I not enjoyed it. But that's it for now. I wish you guys the best of success in your positive endeavors. Remember, believe in yourself and uh, whatever it is you're trying to do that's positive. You know, believe that you can do it. Don't give up on yourself. You're not a loser. You're stronger than you think and smarter than you think. Take care. Peace.